Assalamu alaikum dear students hope you are fine by the grace of almighty Allah welcome to NIEVS home school I am Sabrina Hawk assistant teacher of science national ideal English fashion school day shift dear students today I am taking going to take a science class for class one student on the based on fill in the blanks true false and today I will give you your assignment topic Dear students, let's start for our today's topic. First, we will solve, fill in the blanks. First one, animals may be blank or blank. Dear students, the, in the blanks, there will be big or small. Now, second one. We get blanks from sheep. We get wool from sheep. An animal that live on land in and in water is there will be frog. <coughs> the cows are kept in dash that will be shed honey bees make blanks honey bees makes beehive a monkey lives in a tree Meal in the morning, blanks. Meal in the morning, breakfast. Meal at noon, lunch. Now, next one, in between meals, there will be snacks. I use my blanks to taste. I use my tongue to taste. There will be tongue. A house in a tall building, blanks. A house in a tall building, flat. A room where we take bath, blanks. It will be bathroom. Shoes that we wear when it rains, blanks. Shoes that we wear when it rains, gumboot. A room where we cook, blanks. A room where we cook is kitchen I am <coughs> repeating this again animal may be big or small we get wool from sheep an animal that live on land and in water is frog Cows are kept in shed. Honeybees makes beehive. A monkey live in a tree. Meal in the morning, breakfast. Meal at noon, lunch. In between, <coughs> meal snacks. 
I use my tongue to taste. A house in a tall building flat. A room where we take bath, bathroom. Shoes that we wear when it rains, gumboots. A room where we cook, kitchen. Dear students, now we will solve true false. First one, we wear same clothes at different times. Dear students, this is false statement. That's why we will write here if. Because we don't wear same cloth at different time. <coughs> Second one, food helps us to grow and stay healthy. Dear yes, student, this is correct statement. Sorry, that will be true. Now, next one, our hands, legs, head, stomach and chest are sense organ. Dear students, this is wrong statement because our eyes, ears, nose, tongue, skin is our sense or are our sense organs. That's why there will be F. We get sweet water from rivers. Dear students, this is correct statement. That's why we have to write here T. Sea water is salty. Dear student, this is also correct statement. That's why we will write here T. Saving water is not important. Dear student, this is wrong statement because saving water is very important for us. That's why we will write here F. Next one, we should leave the tap water running. This is wrong or false statement because we should not leave the tap water running. This is wasting of water. And this is so harmful for us. That's why we will write here F. Now we will go for next one. It rains lightly in monsoon. Dear student, this is also wrong statement because in monsoon it rain heavily. We have to write here if. Next one, the wind is cold on a cold day. This is correct statement. That's why we will write here T. We wear cotton clothes on a rainy day. Dear student, this is wrong statement because we wear raincoat and gumboot on a rainy day. We have to write here F. We wear gumboots on a rainy day. This is correct information because on a rainy day we wear gumboot. That's why we have to write here T. Next one. Animals are big and small. This is also correct statement because animals may be big or small. Next one. Insects are the animals with four legs. Dear student, this is wrong information. Uh, it, <coughs> this statement is incorrect. In, in, insects are the animals with six legs. That's why we have to write here if. Next one, we get many things from animals. This is correct information because we get so many things from animals. We have to write here T. Last one, animals need food to live. Dear student, this is correct information. That's why we have to write here T. Dear students, <coughs> now we have to discuss about our assignment. Look, this is the picture of your assignment. You have, this is the topic of assignment, the process of growing plant from seed. Dear students, you have to draw this picture and these steps also. You have to draw the total thing and you have to label here the this is written the seed is buried in the soil you have to label this one also now look the next step here is written it opens now next go to the next the root begins to grow 
now go to again the next picture here is nothing labeling the, the next one the shoot grows that one is coming out shoot is coming out uh, on the up <coughs> above the soil and the root is go to the underground now go to the next there is the shoot grows taller and last one here they are indicating this is root this is stem this is leaf this total picture you have to draw and you have to uh, label total picture this is the labeling all are the labeling and you have to draw color and label this total picture as your assignment and you have to write on the page this <coughs> germination is the process by which a plant grows from a seed dear students you have to write like this assignment topic the process of growing plants from seed <coughs> Uh, and you have to draw label and color the picture in a four size offset paper and your submission date is 4th october that is sunday and this one is your homework they are student this is your assignment and this one is your homework this is homework number 19 you have to do as your homework fill in the blanks and you have to submit on sunday dear students Assignment is too much important topic for you because you will get 10 marks on the best on your assignment performance and it will be added with your annual term. So do it carefully on A4 size offset paper. You have to draw, label and color the picture and you have to write the definition of germination. However, I do it, you also follow this that one and you will do it clearly, correctly and properly. You have to submit on 4th October because you will get on this 10 marks. Dear student, I have finished my today's topic. Hope you have understood. If you feel any problem, you can contact with me. I have given my contact number and my messenger ID on the board. Keep practicing, learn all previous question answer and all the exercises. <coughs> stay safe, stay home. Thank you. Allah Hafiz.